All right, buckle up, fam, because we're diving headfirst into the whirlwind of entertainment happenings. Check it out. Chung Yi ain't just your average Joe in the entertainment biz. Dude's been hustling since 2011, but he wasn't exactly hogging the limelight back then. You know, started off with a lil role in Noble Aspirations where he was chillin' in the background. But hey, after grinding for eight long years, my man finally snagged himself a lead role in Love and Redemption. And last year, oh, last year was lit with mysterious Lotus casebook blowing up screens everywhere. Dude's now the new king of the castle, leaving his senior, Ren Jialun, in the dust. So, Chung Yi teamed up with Lee Yitong early last year for some kick-ass martial arts drama called Hero Legends. Wrap that up mid-2023, and guess what? They're back at it again with Fox Spirit Matchmaker Sword and Beloved this year. And let me tell ya, some leaked footage of their fight scenes, pure fire yo. Lee Yitong's rocking that pink ear, slicing and dicing with her sword like a true boss. But Chung Yi, man, he's matching her move for move, keeping it smooth like butter. Almost had Lee Yidong tripping with his slick moves, but she ain't mad, nah, she just cracks up laughing, digging the vibe they got going. And even with Chung Yi just showing his back, you can feel that hero energy radiating off him. Chemistry, they got it in spades, my peeps. Now you might be wondering how they cook up that chemistry so fast. Well, Lee Yidong spilled the beans on the big hit is coming. Turns out when they crossed paths on Keep Running Yellow River in 2020, sparks were flying. So they decided to team up for Hero Legends. But Lee Yidong felt like they needed more time together on screen, so they jumped on Fox Spirit Matchmaker Sword and Beloved to deepen that connection. Smart move if you ask me. Oh, and let's not forget Chung Yi's off-screen antics, y'all. This dude, playing the brainiac martial artist in Mysterious Lotus Casebook, keeps netizens cracking up with his goofy shenanigans. Like, homeboy recently popped up in a live stream for Makeup Forever. Bet y'all never thought martial arts and makeup could go hand in hand, huh? Gotta love this guy's vibe. Now let's dish out the latest scoop on Yang Yang, the heartthrob of the screen. This dude's got the looks and the charm, often playing tough roles like cops and soldiers, yeah dig? But last year, he teamed up with Wang Chiran for Fireworks of My Heart, and oh boy did sparks fly. Rumors started buzzing about a real-life romance, but alas, the drama tanked harder than a lead balloon. We're talking a cringe-worthy rating of 2.7 on Do Bon, making it mainland China's biggest drama dud of the year. Ouch, the public wasn't pulling punches either. Yang Yang and Wang Chiran caught some flack, and to top it off, their love story crashed and burned quicker than a paper plane in a storm. Talk about a bummer, huh? But hold up, Yang Yang ain't one to let a little drama get him down. Homeboy's hustling hard to bounce back, and he's doing it through his work. Dude was all business on the set of The Immortal Ascension, but those action scenes took a toll, man. His old injury acted up again, leaving him hobbling around like a wounded warrior. Fans couldn't help but feel for the guy, seeing him all frail and lean, rocking them crutches like a champ. Now peep this, Yang Yang's gearing up for a new gig alongside Tian Shiwei, adapting some fantasy novel vibes. It's called Yue Duwa Luo Changhai Wa Kai by Jun Zijia. We're talking ancient times, where gods and mystical creatures rule the roost. Yang Yang's playing Yijia, the big shot deity, while Tian Shiwei's bringing the heat as Luo Wei, a royal chick who's dealing with some supernatural smackdowns. Drama's got it all. Action, intrigue, and a hint of romance brewing in the mix. Initially, they had Zhang Lingha lined up for the gig, but dude's recent flicks, Tiger and Crane and Story of Kun Ning Palace, didn't quite hit the mark with audiences. Investors started sweating bullets, wondering if he had the juice to carry a show. That's where our man Yang Yang swoops in, with Lin Yufen, the maestro behind Love O2O calling the shots. They're betting big on Yang Yang to steal the spotlight. So, Zhang Lingha out and Yang Yang's in baby. Talk about a casting shakeup that's got tongues wagging. And hey, speaking of dedication, let's give a shout out to Zhang Ruyin. This dude's been on a roll, exploring every nook and cranny of the acting universe, and let me tell ya, he's been leaving a trail of impressed fans in his wake. Let's kick things off with Joy of Life. This gem hit the screens back in 2019, and Zhang Ruyin's portrayal of Fan Xian had us all glued to our seats. Political intrigue, suspense, and a sprinkle of romance, this show had it all. And that season one cliffhanger, sheesh, talk about leaving us hanging. But fear not, fam, cause season two's on the horizon. And the anticipation, through the roof. With over 12 million reservations already locked in, it's safe to say that fans are chomping at the bit for the next chapter. But wait, there's more. Zhang Ruyin ain't content to rest on his laurels. Nah, he's out there snagging roles left and right, and the critics can't get enough. Sword, Snow Stride, Ordinary Greatness, these shows ain't just one hit wonders. They're coming back for round two, and Zhang Ruyin's leading the charge. Netizens are even joking around, calling him the king of delayed roles. Hey, better late than never, am I right?
and let's talk versatility, people. Zhang Ruoyan's been flexing his acting muscles like nobody's business, from playing a math whiz with autism and under the microscope, to transforming into an inspirational teacher in the hope. This dude's like a chameleon, blending seamlessly into every role he takes on. It's no wonder he's got the whole industry buzzing. But hold on to your hats, cause there's a new drama on the block, and it's got tongues wagging. Blood Problem is the name of the game, and Zhang Ruoyan's teaming up with none other than Ma Sichen, the Golden Horse Award winner from Soulmate. This ain't your run-of-the-mill drama, folks. Oh no, we're talking family drama, love triangles, and enough mystery to keep you guessing till the very end. With Zhang Ruoyan and Ma Sichen leading the charge, you just know it's gonna be an epic ride. But of course, no drama worth its salt is without its fair share of, well, drama. Seems like we've got some behind-the-scenes shenanigans brewing. Zhang Ruoyan was all set to team up with Shin Ji Lei, but she pulled a disappearing act faster than you can say plot twist. Then there was talk of Tang Yan swooping in to save the day, but alas, she's vanished into thin air too. Now, they're pinning their hopes on Huang Zhao Lei to fill the void, but netizens ain't exactly thrilled about it. They were hoping for some Shin Ji Lei or Tang Yan magic to spice things up, but hey, that's showbiz for you. So, strap yourselves in, cause Blood Problem might be facing a a few bumps in the road, but with Zhang Ruoyan leading the charge, you can bet it's gonna be one heck of a roller coaster ride. Last but not least, get ready to be served a piping hot dish of drama because Song Yi is back with a bang. She's teaming up with Shei Shaman and Li Chun for the upcoming series Fry Me to the Moon, This Ain't Your Grandma's Soap Opera, folks. Premiering on the 29th, this show's gonna flip your world upside down. So what's the scoop? Well, imagine this. You've got Lu Junjun, played by the fabulous Song Yi, a Chengdu chick hustling in the big city of Beijing. She's got her ride-or-die homegirl Gu Monting, played by Li Chun, by her side, keeping it real. But hold up, things take a spicy turn when Liang Qingran, Qiu Shei Shaman, a hotshot in the catering game, crashes their party. Liang Qingran ain't just stirring the pot, she's straight up flipping it. She pulls Lu Junjun's man from Beijing back to Chengdu, shaking things up like a bartender at a cocktail party. Suddenly, there's drama hotter than Sichuan Hot Pot as these three fierce women navigate love, career, and the pursuit of their dreams. In the wild streets of Chengdu, anything can happen, baby. Let's talk talent, shall we? Song Yi's like the Meryl Streep of Chinese TV, slaying every role she touches. From undercover agent to high society hottie, she's done it all and left us wanting more. And Li Qian, don't even get me started. She's gone from northern spy to palace villainess, proving she's got range for days. And then there's Shei Shaman, the OG queen of Hong Kong drama. With 26 years in the game, she's a certified boss. Her last show had viewers hooked like it was Netflix and Chill Night. Move over, dude. There's a new queen in town, with Song Yi, Li Chun, and Shei Shaman bringing the heat. Fry Me to the Moon is gonna be lit. Get ready for a wild ride, cause this drama is gonna have you craving more than just popcorn. So, there you have it, folks. Another week, another round of juicy gossip and hot tea. Don't forget to drop your thoughts in the comments. And until next time, stay fabulous, my friends.